Very good morning, children. In this video, we are going to discuss tongue. Before that, as uh, always, the last video's question: What was the gap that exists between the teeth in rabbit? Yes, many of you answered very correctly. It is diastema. So it is the natural gap that exists between the teeth. Okay. So let us discuss tongue. And you all know tongue is a muscular organ. So what do you think? Is it made of skeletal muscle or smooth muscle or both or none? Yes, it is both. So it is having both skeletal muscle and smooth muscle. Okay. And this skeletal muscle though it is not attached to the bones. It is called muscular hydrostat. Okay. So though it is not attached to any of the bone in the tongue. But it can be able to move. Okay. And uh, we can able to talk and mastigate all that it performs, right? So it is called muscular hydrostat, and it is found in the floor of our buccal cavity. Okay. So let us see. So this is the tip and these are uh, the sides and the uh, back. So in the tip what taste we are diagonizing? Possible question. Of course we diagonize sweet taste. On the sides we diagonize salt and soul. At the back, we diagnose bitter taste. Of course, metallic and alkaline is distributed all throughout. Do you know children, we have more than thousands of taste buds found in our tongue. Now as you know, Rakshita is eating jalebi, which is her favorite food item. Where she will diagnose the taste of the jalebi? Can you post your answers in the comment box? Fine. Now, what are the papillae for the taste buds we have? First one, we call it as circumvallate, which is the largest papillae having four sided walls and few in number. Of course, it is not scientific, just to make you remember, I have drawn the diagram. It is largest with a four sided wall, very few in number. At the back, you can find these sort of papillaries. Second one, fungi form. Why it is called fungi form? Because it is mushroom shaped, so only it is fungi form. More in number. Of course, in front, we can find these fungi form sort of. Papillaries. Third one, filamentous. As the name implies, it is filamentous in shape and it is non-gustatory in function. Non-gustatory, it is not going to diagnose any taste. And we have foliage, which is Leaf like papillae. So, this is regarding papillae. Now, please, you can just touch the tongue with your upper jaw. Can you feel a bone there? Yes, it is palate. Okay. So, if you feel that palate, in the beginning you can find the roughness because like these striations are found. These are called rugae. 
and when do get present it is called hard palate at the back you do not have any rugae it is very soft right that it is called soft palate of course you know the tongue is attached to the floor of the buccal cavity on posterior side it is attached but anterior side it is free but even then it is attached to the floor of the buccal cavity by a strip of muscle can you able to feel it when you lift your tongue you can able to feel a strip of muscle here which is called frenulum very important question children frenulum a strip of muscle which attach the floor of buccal cavity and tongue okay are you all clear about this tongue and i told you about taste buds and it is innervated by nerves so assume that you are eating any food we have cilia which is called stereocilia okay and these are this uh, papillae so whatever we eat mixed with saliva along with the cilia it creates a deflection in the nerve so that we can able to diagnose what are we eating are we eating a sweet or are we eating a biryani whatever it is of course the nerves are glossopharyngeal and hypoglossal so these are the two nerves which innervate the tongue and of course the tongue in the middle we can find a small line like which is called lingual separation so that we can able to fold you know, our tongue sometimes so those who are dominant they can fold those who are recessive in the gene they cannot fold okay are you clear children Let me ask you one question. I already asked you. Please post your answers in the comment and support us. Thank you all for watching this video.